hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's exciting to have you and thank you for all your likes thank you for commenting and subscribing and sharing the videos i really appreciate in this video i this is a continuation um of our deep learning series initially i have shown you how in previous video how you can install a deep learning libraries and then i also showed you in another video how you can download a pre-trained model then in this video i will be showing you how you can import the already downloaded pre-trained model that you have into your gis environment and we use the image analyst tool to run the analysis to detect a, a a particular you know pre-trained model content in our study area and i've also gone the study area you see here is sebrin and yeah sebrin is a city in florida and my extent will be downtown sebrin so that's why i already marked made an extent of downtown sebrin you could see that and if you're wondering how i did this um so this is the raster data then this is just a feature class so you went to create this feature class you basically come to your database and open and then go to new and feature class and when you do this you you know leave it as polygon then label it a particular name and click on next and follow through so once you're done with that you can come on the edit tab create and click on this and click on create a feature polygon it could be you know any how shape you want and just mark the extent and click on finish and then you're done so that is it so to get into a video which is um which is important I already pre-trained model the first thing is to the first thing is for us to go to the um the two box and The first thing to do is first to go to the toolbox and locate the deep learning um, toolbox and choose the, the detect object using deep learning. And here we want to import impute a raster, and that would be the saving imagery. And then the mod the model definition, and so this tells us that. We, we could use the JSON or the deep learning model package. So we have the deep learning model package and we'll just get to that. And I already downloaded two in the last video, which is the tree detection and then the, the, the pool. So I will just select the pool and, and allow that to, okay. Uh, the next thing for us to do is to go to the environment. I was still wanting to maintain the same coordinate and extent. For my extent, I would want to use downtown Sebring. But there are a lot of other things you could do here. Current display and you want to make your own shape and all that. Then for the cell size, I would check out the cell size of the raster. That is 0 0.05. I mean 0 0.5. Sorry. And I'm going to paste that. So I'm just going to type it as 0 0.5. And the next thing, the processor, I'm going to 
use the GPU and leave it leave it blank that's like more like the default mode so i think we all said and then i'm gonna run it so it's running but it seems to take a couple of times so i'm just gonna 